Yo, what is going on everyone? Guiding Light here back with another Hogwarts Legacy video. And in this one, I will show you guys how you can get your hands on a flying broomstick. Now, this is definitely one of the coolest and best features in Harry Potter Hogwarts Legacy as of right now, because it does offer you the access to actually free roam around the map a bit faster. Now, not only are there the broomsticks, but there will be mounts as well. But for now, guys, I will show you guys how you can unlock the broomstick. And it is pretty simple to do. Just keep in mind, you will need to have some money saved up in order to go ahead and get one of these broomsticks so in order to get started on trying to unlock the broomstick what you will need to do is complete a few of the main story quests now once you have gotten to about level 10 you will unlock the main story mission which will have you unlock the ability to get brooms so eventually once you guys have gotten to this part of the story it will be like I said, about the time you hit level 10 to 12, just depending on how many side missions you do, you will receive a quest which tells you guys to go to flying class. Now, once the flying class is over, one of your classmates will inform you guys where it is you guys can actually go ahead and get your very own broom. And once you guys do have the broom, you'll be able to free roam around the map with it as you please. So I will show you guys exactly how to go ahead and go to the shop and get your hands on one of these brooms. Now, keep in mind, before getting to the shop, you will need about 600 gold in order to pick up one of these brooms. So if you guys don't have one on you, make sure that you have the money on you, or at least make sure you have some gear that you're able to sell. So in order to get started, guys, what you'll do is open up the map, go to the Hogsmeade map, and you wanna look for the Quidditch symbol, which is gonna be at the bottom right corner. Now, if you guys have explored most of Hogsmeade already, you should be able to fast travel in right next to the shop. But if not, just fast travel to the closest location that you guys have next to the shop right here and then just simply head over there. So you can set it as a waypoint and just find the closest fast travel that you can. Hogsmeade. So once you guys have gotten to Hogsmeade, just simply go to the broom shop. Like I said, guys, you'll need about 600 gold in order to do this. Now there are actually some things that you'll want to collect once getting in here, as there are one of these field upgrade pages and there is actually a few chests in here as well, which will give you guys your own rewards. So once you've collected this chest and everything, go ahead and talk to the store owner. After talking with him, he will give you access to his shop where you can then pick your very own broomstick. Now each broomstick is gonna have its own features and stuff like that, but it doesn't necessarily tell you what they are right away. And also just keep in mind, you will be able to upgrade these brooms as well later down the road. So just pick whichever one you guys like the best and you'll be able to buy more later on if you guys want. Now, just very quickly guys, I will show you guys some gameplay of the broomstick once you guys have picked it up. You will not be able to necessarily fly it everywhere, but you just can't be in a main city because there's too many people walking around and stuff like that. So you have to go over to the open area, but as soon as you do get into the open area, you will be able to spawn the broomstick as you please and ride it around the map. Which So no longer will you necessarily have to use those fast travel locations because it'd be a lot more fun just to simply fly around and see what you guys can discover now that you guys have the broomstick. So that's pretty much it for this one, guys. I wanted to let you guys know exactly how you can get your hands on this broomstick. I know it's one of the most sought after items in the game, as of right now so hopefully this video helps you guys out to go ahead and get it if you're new to the channel be sure to subscribe as i will be uploading a ton of harry potter legacy guides to help you guys out along the way but that's pretty much it for this one guys so i will catch you in the next one peace